Hello, Southfish community, and welcome back to another World Tanks console video. So, in this video, I'm going to be driving the AMX ELC Best. So, I'm also going to be bottom tier on Steps. A really good map for a light tank. I'm going to be playing the Forgotten Light Tank of Tier 5. The AMX ELC Best used to be one of the most popular Tier 5 light tanks. And you used to see them everywhere. When you were in a, like a tier 5, 6, or 7, or an 8 match, you would see them all the time. But now, you don't. So, on the past 30 days, the AMX DLC BIS has only been in 4,000 battles on the PlayStation 4, and 3,000 battles on the Xbox servers. So, that's a lot lower than what it used to be. You, you would, I don't have like an exact number, but I can tell you in 30 days, the more than likely it would be like 20,000 battles of these tanks played. That's a lot. Because you would see these in almost every single game, game you were in. Why? Because you were small. You had really good concealment, really good spotting. You were fast. Now, to mention you were small, and you have a big gun at tier 5, a 90mm. Basically, you can just hide in plain sight like I'm doing if you never fired that 90mm. I'm hiding in plain sight. Well, not hiding in plain sight, just hiding behind a bush, but you know what I mean. But yeah, the AMX CLC Biss was a really good tank. Then the light tank happen like it was a tier 5 tank that played up the tier 8 light used to play up the three tiers basically tier 5 light tanks used to be they were tier 5 light tanks but they played like tier 6s then when the light tank update came it ruined tier 5 light tanks tier 5 light tanks used to be one of the funnest tier 5s one of the funnest light tanks to play in the game. You had the Amex, ELC Biss, and the Chaffee. Those two were the rivals at tier 5 for light tanks. You also had the Russian T-50 and the German Leopard. And now we have the Stubbs. But yeah. And I also think we have the Crusader. But with the light tank update, it nerfed tier 5 light tanks. I don't have the uh, stats of the Almec CLC BIS, what they were, but I know the BIS got slower, the reload got longer for the 90mm, but for the 76mm, you had a turret. You had a fully turn you could turn your turret all the way around. But with the 90mm, you can't. You have a small place you can play. Small you can only turn your left, you can only turn your gun left to right so far. They nerfed the uh, spotting to 360 meters, which sucks. Also, your signal range absolutely blows at 400 meters. So basically, if you like, I got this with like spotting and concealment, like a whole bunch of spotting capabilities, you can outspot than what you can see. Basically, you can spot people over 400, you can spot 445 meters view range. Is it 445? Yes, yeah, 445 is the maximum spotting range you can spot. So, if you get to that, you can't see that far. So, if they nerf the signal range, the signal range absolutely sucks. Your top speed is... It's 60 kilometers. I believe it was like a 70 before. Uh, your hit points was decreased to 320. Don't think about armor because you never had any and you will never have any. You may get a lucky and bounce a couple of shots once in a while. Your concealment is really good at 0.38 and 0.38 while moving and stationary. But the real reason people really like this tank is the 90mm. 
and you fire 4.29 rounds per minute. Your damage is 240 on your standard and premium, and 320 on your height explosive. Penetration is 120 on your standard, 150 on your premium, and 45 on your height explosive. Aim time is 2.9, and accuracy is 0.38. It's basically the MX ELC best. You played this tank to be hidden all the time and have that big gun. Most people play this like a sniping tank. The reason I'm playing this tank is because if you know the wild light tanks are coming the French wild light tanks are coming in early 2020 and they're going to be sprouting off from the AMX ELC best. So if you want to play the wheeled light tanks, then you got to get the Amex ELC best. Plain and simple. I talked through this entire match. And basically, yeah. Teens capping. We died. We did pretty good. We got a kill. 2,885 assists. 899 damage. And we capped and killed all the tanks. So, pretty good match. We got a victory on stats. And we are bottom tier. Remember, I only had one mark of excellent. And this is also the game that gets me my two mark of, uh, second mark of excellence. There we go. Ace Mastery Bad, second mark of excellent. Scout and Patrol Duty. And we should be top of the leaderboards. Are we top of the leaderboards? I'm just going to look at the mark of excellence. That's all I'm going to do. We are top of the leaderboards. We are only fired six shells. Yeah, so. Well, if you like this video, remember, like, comment, and subscribe. Awesome, it's like this because what was that? And peace out. See ya.